Good day, YYZ Frank, YYZ Review, Tailgate Pizza. Uh, we have to be creative. Uh, we're in a Green Pea parking lot, we're downtown. Uh, shout outs to Toronto Food Reviews. He gave me the rare opportunity to come and be part of the uh, a special night of food, food blogging at uh, this place. Uh, unfortunately that night I couldn't make it, but um, I came down. Uh, big Three Pizza, Detroit South Pizza, which is becoming a big hit in Toronto. Um, uh, so yeah, with the thick crust cheese to the edge, um, price point was 18 bucks. I threw in a $2 tip, um, enthusiastic, uh, staff over there. Uh, he just works there, but he says he would give his pizza an 8.5. Uh, yeah, what else? Um, so again, I have special guest Mike here, um, to do, um, um, Busta, Busta Cusa. He was close with the last score. Uh, off by 0 0.1 of a score. Uh, sorry, you have to get it right on in order to get the, the $20. Um, what else is there to add about this? Yeah, that's it. So like I said, we're down on Yorkville in a, in a green pea parking. Mike, uh, Detroit style pizza, cheese to the end. And to take a bite and see how it goes. There's your pizza and that's the, the crust. Two bite system. Tailgate pizza, never trust a skinny foodie. Mm. Okay. I like the freshness of the, the sauce, but that's how all Detroit pizza is. The dough could have been a little more crispier and a little more cheese. Mike, what do you think of this Detroit style pizza from Big Three Pizza? Sauce tastes really good. It's pretty thin for uh... Detroit, yeah. Yeah, Detroit, sorry. Just checking it out. Um,. Yeah, it tastes really good. Oily. Um, you need, definitely need napkins, especially if you've got a beard like mine. Definitely need napkins. Very messy. Yeah, very messy. Um, I'm going to go 7 2. Yeah, it's um, definitely not in the eights. Nothing against the gentleman that worked at Big Three. Um, I'm going to go. Could have stayed in the oven a bit longer. Yeah, the dough could have been crispier. More cheese on the dough. I'm going to go 7. Um, Paul Coffee, 7.7. .7. Now, Mike here, this fine young man who we have the same knowledge of pizza and love of pizza, said I should start sampling their special sauce and give it a, a score. So it's a jalapeno blend um, made in house daily. Uh, oh yeah, I don't know if I mentioned it, but it is true. Uh, this place was uh, featured on a few magazines. Once they sell out their dough, they close shop. Even though they're open from 11 till 10, they sell dough, dough their cold shop because it's a small place and they only have so much room. Let's try their special sauce. How is it, Mike? He said it's very spicy. It's not super spicy. I mean, I only dipped in a little bit, but you can taste how really fresh that that uh, dipping sauce is. Mm -hmm. So it's actually pretty good. Yeah, the freshness of the sauce is nice. I'm gonna double dip because I don't give them. Yeah, it's it is good. Um, See, I didn't swear this time. <laughs> so the dip is good, uh, but overall. 7.7 .7 Detroit style pizza, big three, downtown Toronto. Again, Toronto food reviews. I hope we could do a review together soon. Thanks for the original invite. YYZ Frank, YYZ review. Never trust a skinny foodie. Remember, comment, like, share, subscribe. Oh yeah, for those, those of you who don't know, I started a, um, a merch line. Never trust a skinny foodie. Here's the link on Shopify. Uh, support, I will only keep the store open for another month. If no sales, I'll shut it down. You guys asked for it, I tried to supply. Thanks for watching, have a good day.